Hello everybody, welcome to my cooking show. I would like to welcome my guest. This is Annie, Annie Blake. She's an amazing artist and you're also a blog editor yep. for Freshly Picked, mm -hmm. right? Awesome. We love that blog. Thank you for being the blog <laughs> editor of it. You're amazing. Thanks. So do you ever cook? Do you cook very much? I do love to cook. Really? Yeah. So do you like curry? Love curry, but we it takes a, a long away time. From a Thai restaurant, do you really? That's so awesome. You go there a lot. Do you go there for breakfast? Like I seriously love eating curry for breakfast. I make this stuff and then I'll eat it like the next day for breakfast. Yeah. So we're gonna make some curry, but this is really fast curry. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. So it's called sweet potato curry. We're gonna put a little bit of red pepper and onions in there as well. But we've got a sweet potato right here. Would you want to help me chop sure. or cut? Actually, I'll be chopping. You'll be more like slicing. So if you just want to put these into bits. So, um, this, ha it's one can of full fat coconut milk, and a lot of people get really worried about that, but coconut fat is so good for you. So, so good for you. So I'm going to show you how I make these go into little squares. So I just kind of cut them into planks like this, and then I just do slices this way, and then you turn them this way, make little squares. So I'm not going to cut this entire thing on the set. <laughs> Let's do a couple more. Look at you. You're amazing. <laughs> You're an artist and a cook and a writer. And an eater. Oh, I, me too. <laughs> I'll tell you. I'm a super eater. I'm a specialized super eater. I should get a certificate <laughs> in it. So we've got some onions here. I always say I have people cut my onions for me because if I cut these on set right now, we'd have to like cut Sorry. and I'd be like, Annie, where are you? <laughs> so, yes, please. And I'm going to reach over you and put the onions in there. So, 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 so easy. So, and then we can put this whole can of the full fat coconut milk in there. Mm. And then what I like to do, cause that's in, that's really thick and intense and it's a little bit heavy. Mm -hmm. So I like to dilute it with just a little water. Do you want to put that water in for us? Thank you. And then we put quite a bit of salt in because there's no salt in here. We want to make it taste good. And then this is where the easy part comes. So this is green curry paste. It looks kind of weird. <laughs> it looks like some grass that somebody chewed up and then spit back in here, <laughs> which is kind of what it is. No, but it's green curry paste. You can buy this at the store. It stays f good forever in your fridge. You can buy red curry paste and yellow curry paste and can you buy orange curry paste? <laughs> Maybe you're like, I'm on your show, Melissa. I don't know. Smell that though. So good. Isn't it crazy? Yeah. So it's got basil, a little, um, a little lemongrass, and a bunch of other things that are kind of ground together, and so it's got some heat. It yeah. So it's really easy. So you want to put that in here? Let me give you a fork to put that in. And let's see. Oh, and then we've got our cayenne. How hot do you like things? Hot. <laughs> really hot? Awesome. So this is actually 35,000 heat unit cayenne, which sounds like a lot. That sounds way more intense than mild, <laughs> no. medium, medium. <laughs> I know. But the other cayenne, regular cayenne that you just buy off the shelf from the store is about 100,000. Mm. So this is 35,000. So it's less than half of the heat of that. Mm. The reason I love it is because it gives you that cayenne flavor and that, that chili flavor without so much heat. So you mm. can add a lot of it and you still get good heat from it, but you still get that really awesome chili flavor. So we're going to just put that in there. So where do you get the different heat? So I just get this at herb shops. Oh. Anywhere where they sell bulk herbs, you can get it. Like anywhere that has, you know, like catnip and fennel and <laughs> peppermint and rosemary, just all those that you can buy in bulk. You can usually find it there. People use it medicinally sometimes because hmm. cayenne is really good for your heart. But if you take too much of the hot stuff, you, it burns, right? You get, you, you get really hot. So yeah. So what you do is you just turn that on. I mean, we're literally done. Now we just have to let it simmer. And it simmers down until your veggies are tender. And a lot of people don't know this, but sweet potatoes actually cook quite quickly. They cook really fast. So we have some already done. We're going to make it really pretty because I always like to make my food pretty. And you're an artist. I'm sure you do that too, right? Yep. And I take pictures of my food. <laughs> <laughs> I know whenever people make fun of people that who take pictures of their food, I always want counter with, look, it's my business. I'm allowed <laughs> to take pictures of my food. <laughs> okay, so we've got some rice here, a little bit of seasoned rice here, and it's already heated. We've already heated this. Then we have this curry over here, which is already hot as well. And this has the same green curry in it. This has a couple of different ingredients and it. it has the sweet potatoes in it, but I put a ton of spinach in here. Oh, so you okay. literally can put whatever veggies you want in there. So we're gonna pour this over the top. 
And then we gotta make it look gorgeous. So we have some, these are just some spring green leaves right here. How does that look? Does, is that starting to look good? Okay, I'm gonna let you, because I totally trust you with this, <laughs> go ahead and make it beautiful with that little cayenne right there. <laughs> you, you can do this now, just don't make the mistake of rubbing your eyes. Oh no, don't touch it. Yeah, do that, do it that way. <laughs> and then I'm gonna let you taste it. So since you like hot, you know, I'm glad I'm making you do it because then we can blame it on you if it's too hot. <laughs> so pretty. I love that. See, I was totally, see, perfect. Oh, you're amazing. That's what I was going to say. I'm like, put a little like over there on the edge of the plate. Okay, here's your fork. You want to try it? Sure. Okay, let's go. Get like a giant bite of cayenne in there. <laughs> this one isn't too hot, actually. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wow. It's good, huh? It's really good. It tastes just like we're at the store. Yeah. I'm not the store. The Thai restaurant. The that's, store. That's that'd be awesome if they sold this stuff at the store. Yeah. I know, right? That's Isn't it really easy? Good. And it freezes well. And I, it stores in your fridge for a long time, too. So a lot of times I'll make a big pot of this and eat on it throughout the week. So there you go, Annie. Thank you so much Thank for being you. on. You're so sweet. <laughs> we'll have you on again sometime. All right. Bye. Thanks for watching. <laughs>